warm welcome students of this academy today i am going to share with you chapter 9 question answer and this is your revision time on a few okay so you have to completely focus on this revision okay so now i am going to start this question number 1 and also describe okay have you ever seen the mountains have you also climbed a mountain when and where so yes answer is yes last summer we went to shimla okay where we not only saw mountains but also climbed up so you have to fill place name it completely depends you what are you using okay next is how far have you walked at one time how far can you walk so like i have walked about 7 to 8 km at one time and i think i can walk as far as up to 15 km at a time okay what do you think about the paths on the mountains draw a picture pass means raste okay so this is an activity work this is an activity work students are suggested to draw mountains okay what do you think about the responsibilities of a group leader so answer is the responsibilities of a group leader are challenging and of giving self satisfaction again the responsibilities of a group leader are challenging and of giving self satisfaction satisfaction you can see the question number 5 how would you feel if you were made a leader in such a camp so if i were if i were made a leader in such a camp it would boost my confidence means boost means badhana okay grow karna apne aap mein if i were made a leader in such a camp it would boost my confidence that i was trusted upon for the job i would take up the full responsibility okay this is the question number 6 what does what does a monitor in your class have to do okay so in our class the responsibilities of a monitor are to maintain discipline in the classroom to arrange request things like chalks dusters this will etc to convey the problems of a student to the concerned teacher or headmaster okay okay so to convey the problems of a student to the concerned teacher or headmaster would you like to be the class monitor why yes i would like to be the class monitor it will be a wonderful experience to lead my class what kinds of tools are needed for climbing mountains so for climbing mountain we need a thick rope sling stick etc beside these things food packets water bottle hook plastic seat diary torch towel soap wind cheater whistle okay whistle glucose jaggery chana snacks etc are also required clear okay so what kinds of tools are needed for climbing mountains so for climbing mountain we need a thick rope sling stick etc besides these things food packets water bottle hook plastic seat diary torch towel soap wind cheater okay wind cheater whistle glucose jaggery chana snack etc are also required now you can see the next question have you ever seen a hook and rope being used for anything else where well, yes they are used to pull water buckets from a well or to pull heavy goods upwards etc besides i have also watched on tv tv okay so now besides i have also watched on tv maroon people being pulled up by the helicopters during rescue operations again 
Yes, they are used to pull water buckets from a well or to pull heavy goods of food, etc. Besides, I have also watched on TV marine people being pulled up by the helicopter during rescue operations. Question number 10. What else can we use if we want to cross a river in the mountains? To cross a river in the mountains, we need thick rope, sling and and patience. Okay? Okay? So, to cross a river in the mountains, we need thick rope, sling and pitons. Why do we need extra energy on the mountains? This is because we have to rise up against the gravitational force. Further, it is tough to walk over the rocky surface of mountains in comparison to the flat surface of plains. Okay, why do we need extra energy on the mountains? This is because we have to rise up against the gravitational force. Further, it is tough to walk. Okay, tough to walk over the rocky surface of mountains in comparison to the flat surface of plains. Have you ever heard of anyone who has done something adventure? What? Yes, one of my friends went for tracking last summer. It was really adventurous. Have you ever done anything adventurous? If yes, tell your class. Write about it in your own words. Answer. Last summer when I went to Simla, I crossed a mountain river using rope, sling and pitons as mentioned in the chapter. It was a very adventurous experience. Have you ever climbed a tree? How did you feel? Were you scared? Did you ever fall? Yes, once I climbed a tree, it was a very exciting experience, though I was not scared at all while climbing, but once I climbed up and looked down for a moment, of course, I got scared, I had never fallen. Have you ever seen someone climb a small wall? What do you think is the difference between climbing a wall and climbing a high rock? Yes, I saw it many times, I think climbing a high rock may be a bit easier than climbing a wall. Because the surface of a rock is irregular with elevation and depression forming holes. Where one, where one, where one can put his or her hand and feet while the surface of a wall is smooth and flat. Thus it is difficult to climb a wall. Question number 16. Is there anyone in your class whose language you do not understand or who does not understand yours? What do you do in such a case? So yes, few days back, a boy from Kerala had joined our class. We didn't know each other's language, so we talked using gestures and enjoyed very much doing so. Have you ever lost your way? What did you do then? Yes, one or two times I have lost my way. In that case, I asked the local people to help me in finding out my way. Why do you think? Why do you think Kondor B would have sung loudly? So Kondor B would have sung loudly, so that the group could listen and find them again easily. C may also be doing so to. C may also be doing so to get over here, over her fear. C may also be doing so. To get over her fear. Fear means? Yes. Dear. Have you ever seen someone doing something special to get over their fear? What and when? Yes. Once riding on a high rise swing, we were shouting and yelling to get over our fear and also to enjoy. Ask your friend for a book without speaking. Try to explain something to the class in the same way. Students, please ask a book from your friend using gesture only. Discuss. Why do you think a drain was dug around the tent? Drain was dug to keep off insects, scorpio, snakes, etc. So besides mountaining, besides mountaining, what are other activities that can be called adventures? Why skydiving, gliding, hot air ballooning, round, uh, rowing in mountains, rowing. Uh, Roaming in mountain rivers are some of the other activities that can be adventurous. Again, skydiving, gliding, hot air balloon, running in mountain rivers are some of the other activities that can be adventurous. You are on a mountain. How do you feel there? What can you see? What do you feel like doing there? I feel very excited to climb up on a mountain. I can see high mountains all around. 
in between there are deep valleys there are also many trees all around covered with flowers the whole landscape is very beautiful and i feel as i have come to heaven i want to climb higher heaven means swarg okay why did bachindri put up the indian flag on the peak in honor of country bachindri put up the indian flag on the peak okay when have you seen our national flag being hoisted hoisted collect information of our national flag besides republic day independence day our national flag has three colors white orange and green in the middle of it has ashok chakra have you seen the flag of any other country where yes in chanakya puri delhi where embassies of different countries are based i have seen the flag of many countries make groups of six eight children design a flag for your group explain why you choose that design this is a group activity okay can see there question number 28 what we have learned explain why it can be adventures and challenging to climb a mountain how would you prepare if you were climb a mountain what would you take with you write in your own words so you have to use your only your own words like mountains are full of dangers river deep valleys irregular surfaces etc to cross these are very challenging tasks second it is not easy to climb on the steep slope of the mountains it requires a lot of zeal and vigor if i were to climb a mountain i would have taken along with me foot packets water bottle rope hiking shoes hook plastic say diary torch towel soap winchito whistle glucose jaggery chana snacks etc okay not snacks snacks okay snacks etc besides i would snacks very mistake all of you as an ac yes okay uh, besides i would also carry a camera to catch the beautiful picture so this is your own this work is you have to do in your own words so like like this uh, which here presented okay so this was is your chapter and you have to repeat your these question answers in your book also and also mention it in your book and uh, yeah i already know that you have already men- mentioned because this is your revision class okay and uh, also revise previous question which i have already given you okay and if you have any queries regarding today class you can send uh, send an email then i will definitely reply them and also you have to mention your everything whatever you need okay in during exam time okay